Hello everyone, today I'm back and I'm reviewing this tablet which I've given it a second chance, um, never better said. Uh, first time I received it, it would not accept SIM cards, um, it would just not go on 4G, um, must have been a faulty one. Um, I looked around and then I finally decided to go back with this one again. Um, I'm going to tell you exactly why, I'm also going to show you how you will receive it. It's very well presented. Okay, let me see if I can get it out with my nails. It's terrible. It's a 10.1 um, tablet. It's a very good size. Yes, it is a little slightly on the heavy side, but it does have, um, you know, it comes packed with a lot of specs. So, obviously, um, to put all the hardware on it, it needed to have this kind of thickness. It's not uncommon, to be honest. Um, it's about 500 grams just over I don't think it's an issue to be honest with you um, you have to think of everything you get in not only focus on the price so you get all the instruction manuals guarantee um, silica gel very dangerous for kids and pets a couple of more papers and then obviously you get I've just left this in the way I can't get it out there we go, um, to insert the SIM, which my partner has done for me, is the UK 3-pin plug for you to put on the mains. It has the USB. And then it comes with a Type-C charger, which means it's going to charge fast. It has a very good battery. Um, so it's going to last a long time. That's I. That's one of the things I was really looking for, um, a big battery, because you don't. It, this is for my son, and you don't realise. And they do play a lot on a tablet, do a lot of things, watch a lot of videos, and by the time, you know, they do otherwise um, go flat very quickly. So what I have done, I've gone on the EE website and just got him a SIM. And now his tablet, the good thing about this tablet is that it has a telephone number. So he'll be able to download apps like Snapchat and WhatsApp. Not only the desktop version, but the full version. Um, he's going to bombard me with WhatsApp so I can see it coming. Another reason why I bought this um, tablet is because it has 4 gigabyte of RAM. So it's going to be fast when you do things with it. But also, I bought it because it has a 128 gigabyte ROM, which means that he can download games, Roblox, all the games he uses, and he's not going to run out of storage. You can also insert an SD card for extra storage, but as I've said, it's more than enough just to have um, the 128 gigabyte. I'm not going to have to worry how many times with um, other tablets you know they download a couple of games and then they moan because they can't get to download everything this one comes ready with the app play store which is another must i need to set it all up obviously nothing's been set up because uh, he's going to have it for christmas i'm going to set google parent as well um so if he wants to download anything he's going to have to ask me for permission it has a very clear platform. It's going to be very easy to navigate and work with. It has YouTube. Let's put... Let me raise the volume. This is Tommy Berry. You know, so the volume, for the purposes we need them for, um, it's really good. I'm not going to moan about it. Um, I don't see, I've, I've heard, read, more like, uh, some people complaining. As you can see, the 4G has gone on. I hope you can see. It's very hard with a camera on a screen. It's one of the hardest things to review. Um, but I like the layout. I like how it comes packed with everything. I like the fact that it has a front camera, which is a 2 megapixel, and then it also has the back camera, 
it is a five megapixel okay the cameras are not wow um i'll take a couple of pictures but they're good enough they're quite you know good for a tablet anyway it has a 10 core processor which means it's fast you can multitask you can have different windows open if you need to it's going to run um if you get lower um processors they're just not going to function they're going to take ages uploading the pages and whatever you're doing it's also running runs on android 8.0 it's not the latest 9.0 but for a tablet more than enough still one of the latest ones for tablets the screen resolution is 2560 times 1600 hd so that does give us a hd picture of the 1920 times 1200 what can i say um could you say it's expensive for a tablet it depends what you're looking for if you're looking for quality you're looking for something sturdy it's very well finished i like the design i like that it has play store and you know what i like the most i like that whatever has been sold to you it's actually what you have because when we, me and my partner were looking for tablets for my son when he had the idea of, you know, I'm going to get him a tablet because his tablet disappeared um, a year ago. And um, we looked and there was cheaper ones, but they were advertised as having X amount of specs. And then when you receive the tablet, they didn't have those specs. So at least with this one, I know I'm getting exactly what I paid for. And I'm very happy with it as an overall. So for us, it's a thumbs up. Another good thing that it has, um, as I said, I'm going to show you, is that he's going to be able to use it as a mobile phone. So I'm going to ring on my phone. He's going to be able to accept calls. He's going to be able to um, make calls. He's going to be able to do everything just like you would with a normal phone so you have a tablet and a phone two in one um i would highly recommend and i'm happy i actually gave it a second chance so yep a clear thumbs up everyone thanks very much for watching